Hi everyone! Welcome to the daily reading for Sunday, September 9th, 2018 for all signs. Thank you so much for joining me. I am the Good, the Bad, and the Tarot. Here to give you your daily messages and energies. And once again, this is for all signs. So um, I definitely will uh, let you know if I pick up on a specific, uh, anything specific, really, specific signs, etc. But uh, this is a reading for the collective, and I am using the Vera Sibilla Italiana today, also known as the Everyday Oracle, aka the Everyday Oracle, and the Romance Angels Oracle cards, and that's it. So it's going to be a pretty short reading. Let's go ahead and get started. Spirit, what are the messages and energies you'd like to share with the collective? for Sunday, September the 9th, 2018, for all signs. What are the messages and energies you'd like to share for Sunday, September the 9th, 2018? What are the most important messages and energies for Sunday, September the 9th? got a couple cards here and I will take actually I will accept these cards and what do we have here all right I pulled the Delirante La Reunione La Legereza Speranza and Domestico all right so uh, I'm definitely seeing um, lots of people, go, lots of interactions here. Um, definitely I'm seeing at least two to three people involved. Um, the first thing I see is that someone is involved in, okay, the Delarante means stupid actions or foolish behavior. So obviously um, this could be something that happened in the past. Uh, it could also be... Um, I'm reading this as like the recent past, so it might have been like a Saturday night outing, something like that. But we have the Delirante, which is people who are engaging in foolish behavior. So people that are just, just they're the delirious, they're doing crazy things, they're, they're going out, maybe. Um, so I'm seeing people going out, having fun, etc. And then I am seeing a romantic encounter. Uh, between two people so some kind of a reunion here now it says romantic encounter or job offer but I'm actually seeing that a bunch of people going out um, foolish behavior um, this can be like someone going out with their friends for example and then I am seeing a romantic reunion now I am seeing that this romantic reunion was um, very sensual. There was actually quite a lot of tact around this reunion, meaning that someone was being very tactful about how they went about it. Um, someone was very sensitive. Um, now, with the lightness card, this also indicates sexuality and freedom of sexuality. So what I'm seeing here is this type, this was a romantic reunion, but it was also not a within a, commi within a commitment. I'm seeing, for example, uh, this was a very um, uh, flirtatious energy I'm seeing. It was also maybe two people that were just getting together, but there wasn't um, uh, maybe the intention behind it for it to be long term. Um, I am seeing um, someone here who is waiting for someone. They're dreaming about this person. Um, they may be very apprehensive about contacting them. Because we have Speranza, which is hope, and as you can see, she's holding the anchor here, so she's not going anywhere. Um, this this person, this energy is not going anywhere. She's just waiting, waiting for maybe someone to contact her, the phone call, etc. Um, but I also feel like you know these two people, when they came together, they had the freedom to do so, and they also have the freedom to to do really whatever they want. So there's no, I'm not seeing that this is necessarily a couple that's in a committed relationship is what I want to say. We also have the Domestico. Now the Domestico is typically a third party. This is someone who can be a helper, an employee, or a collaborator. 
As you can see, he's actually looking directly at the Speranza. So um, I actually feel like uh, this situation is involving, like I said, two people who are not in a formal relationship. One of these people can actually already be in a relationship. Uh, because the domestic, like I said, is usually someone who is a third party, such a, and a third party. Um, let me see what else, because I'm just picking up Jack of Clubs. He's similar to a knight, okay, or even a page. Um, now, what to do, what to do. That's, that's the thing, is that I feel like two people got together here, there was a romantic reunion, um, it wasn't serious, it was actually a very freeing experience, and I feel like someone is waiting for communication. That's kind of the feeling that I'm getting. Uh, but the problem is, is that I feel like this could be... Um, a situation where um, you know someone had to be very tactful about how they went about it um, someone had to be very sensitive um, maybe this was a reunion that took place um, not in the public view like it was a secret reunion a secret encounter and then we also have um, the woman here who was hoping, waiting, dreaming, apprehensive, and the servant who is uh, usually a third party collaborator. The jack of clubs. So the jack would be like the page or the knight. So we're going to go ahead and clarify the overall reading here with the romance angels. Spirit, what do they need to know? I feel like someone wants to know if there's going to be communication. That's what I'm picking up. But both parties are kind of looking at each other. Both parties are kind of waiting uh, for the, what's the next step kind of thing. What do we do now? You know, what's the, um, what's the right protocol at this point? So let's see. What is your guidance for this reading for all signs? Sunday, September 9th, please, 2018. There is some apprehension, there is some tension, because I feel like um, someone here wants to help, but they're not sure how to help, they're not sure how to collaborate, they're not sure how to bring, you know, the two elements together. Express your love again. Oh, it's interesting because we had this the other day. Um, I did a reading for the collective, and that was on the 7th. Yeah. So it says, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Yeah, there's, there's hesitation here. Do I express how I'm feeling? Do I say something? Do I, make, do, I, do I make a move here? Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. It is right to do that. All right, so someone here needs to come forward. Someone here is not speaking up. Someone here doesn't feel like maybe they have the right to do that or that they can do that. It says this card urges you to take the initiative in your love life. That may mean contacting someone to whom you are attracted and asking that person out on a date. Okay, so if you're waiting... If you're waiting for this person to make the first move, don't do that. Go ahead and just act them, ask them out. It could also mean sending flowers, texts, or gifts to your beloved. Yeah, if, if you're waiting to hear from them and you don't hear from them, go ahead and go ahead and make the romantic gesture. As you express romance, these feelings pour through you. You actually become the biggest beneficiary of your romantic displays as you enjoy how they make you feel to an even greater degree. The more you give love, the more you experience it. Of course, do you make sure that you're also open to receiving the love that comes to you from God, the angels, and other people? Obviously, if you don't believe in God, source, creator, um, love, etc., that which you, you know, receive your higher information from your seventh chakra, your divine love. Where do you receive divine love? Be sure you're giving and receiving here. 
So I, I feel like there's a standstill too. People are waiting. They're both kind of looking at each other. Who's going to make the first move? They're saying, if you're watching this reading, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. It is right to do so. Send a text, send flowers, whatever it is. Go ahead and do that. Um, because I feel like otherwise, you know, you're just kind of, um, you're both just going to be playing the waiting game. And so that's what I'm going to probably name this way, this reading is, um, if you're playing the waiting game, you know, don't do that. Go ahead and go ahead and speak up. Now is the time to do that. It's safe for you to do that now as well. Yeah, because clearly there's attraction here. There's love here. Okay, um, this was a romantic encounter. There is love there. It's just that there needs to be fuller expression of it. Express, express, express. Get it out, get it out, get it out. You know. All right, guys, I'm going to leave it right there. Have a wonderful Sunday. Enjoy your weekends. Go out, have fun. Enjoy it. Take care. Oh, if you would like to book a private reading, below in the description is my website and scheduling app. Be sure to check that out. I'll see you guys back tomorrow for another daily reading. Thank you. Take care of yourselves. Goodbye.